Sob's charity actually stands for Survivors Bereaved by Suicide. So it actually is a self-help group um, of people that can come along in a safe space where they can actually share their feelings, their emotions, their fears, their experiences with other people that sadly have been in a similar um, place, are in the same place and have got that empathy because they know what other people are going through. So it's about being able to help each other. It's a nationwide charity. Um, it's been around since the early 1990s and there's about 75 um, self-help groups and we're really pleased that we've at long last been able to bring one to your own. Yeah. I'm bereaved by suicide myself um, and I was only a young girl, I was 14 years old when I lost my 15 year old brother. There was no help 37 years ago or there was certainly no help that we knew of um, and so we mustered our way through as a family, we, we did our best and hopefully we did a good job managing to support each other but that never left me. I always wanted to be able to bring a self-help group where people can actually share those same experiences and understand what people are going through because it is a different grief. Um, it can be very complex for some people because when somebody takes their own life, there's so many other additional emotions like shame, grief, um, guilt. They all come along with a suicidal bereavement. There is certainly a place for counselling and that works for some people. Some people don't want to follow the traditional route of counselling and they just want to be able to share that experience with other people. To be able to feel that there is a safe place where they can say out loud what's really in their heart that they might not be able to say out loud anywhere else.